Uh, I'm Dr. Amir Janian Najaf Abadi. I'm a guest researcher at Construct University and I'm postdoctoral researcher and a lecturer in interdisciplinary neuroscience at uh, Billyfield University. And I'm a joint professor in uh, psychology and neuropsychology at Turo University, Berlin. So, um, uh, several of hundreds of uh, millions of people, I mean, uh, in the globe are suffering from uh, neuropsychiatric and uh, neurological disorders. And and one of the very important uh, line of the research is to find out the neuromarkers or neurobiomarkers of this disease. I'm benefiting uh, from um, a, a very large uh, biobank data sets from America and I'm monitoring this variety of disorders uh, across the um, childhood, adolescents and adults and comparing between different group range to find out uh, neurobiomarkers underlying different disease. So um, for this study, that's a very complex study that I have started six years ago in 2019. The data sets are already collected by a variety of hospitals across the, the, the state from the research centers, which uh, I, I use them to, to apply machine learning and deep learning um, algorithms. So um, the very good things with that is uh, we have a very large data set that we can apply a variety of models to find out um, the neurobiomarkers and to see whether those neurobiomarkers could be used for diagnostic purposes in clinical setting or in research setting. So for, for example, one of the applications and one of our uh, main aims is to see whether if we record brain electrical activity, which we call it EEG in abbreviation, can be used in clinical setting as its own alone or to um, uh, use it as a complementary um, uh, method uh, to diagnose uh, these different diseases like uh, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder or major depressive disorder, uh, generalized anxiety disorder, and so on. 